quite a whirlwind for you. 15 years. How are you feeling? feel great. I'm thrilled to be still doing this show, and um, it's really exciting, and I feel grateful, and I love doing it, and we have some huge shows coming up. Our anniversary special is going to be amazing, and uh, bullish on everything. So tell us about that. Are you getting everybody from the Bravo universe together for that show? No, we're going to get some, some um, <coughs> we're going to get some of our favorites from uh, the Watch What Happens Live canon and Bravo canon to help us look back on 15 amazing years. So what can we do? You need an Emmy for this. How are we going to get you to get an Emmy? How are we going to get me to get an Emmy? I don't know. We're going to, hopefully, Emmy voters will vote for us. And if they don't, hopefully, y'all will just keep watching us. Well, I'm going to keep watching. You created a magical universe. Let's talk about this. Your favorite moment of all time on Watch What Happens Live. I think it was when Oprah was there. It was a very big deal for me personally and professionally, and I just, it meant a lot to me. And you have Rihanna DMing you as well? A little bit. Yeah, it's you're, exciting. You're getting everybody. A-listers, everybody. Yeah. Now, Jersey, there's no reunion. Why that decision? Uh, when you see the finale, you'll see. I mean, I think the finale kind of is a finale and a reunion all in one, and um, there's a lot of speculation about casting for Jersey next season. No decisions have been made. We're nowhere close to making any com any decisions. So don't believe anything you read right now. And uh, I'm thrilled. The rest of the season is great. And I'm excited for everyone to see it. So how does the finale end? Is there truly no hope for Teresa and Melissa? Oh, none at all. Yeah. It's not bad. Yeah. Talking about shakeups, you're bringing Porsche back into the mix for Atlanta. What can we expect? Oh, uh, we're in production now, so <coughs> uh, you just gotta wait and see. And Vanderpump, <coughs> do you have water? It's oh, okay. He's giving you a recall. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Vanderpump, let's talk about that because the finale left everybody a little confused. We had some flashback moments. People are taking that as this may be the end of it. And Ariana said, you know, she won't do this if Tom's there. What are your thoughts? Listen, Vanderpump Rules, which I'm not a producer of anymore, is a big hit show. And so I don't think there's any great mystery about taking a beat and reevaluating and letting people go live their lives. So you think it was like all forced and fake this season? Because I know you guys kind of rushed production. Do I think it was forced and fake this season? No, I don't think it was forced and faked at all. I thought it was a great season, actually. I thought yeah. so, too, but people think that because it was so close in time. Well, we rushed into production because a lot was going on, and uh, but I thought it was quite captivating. And now Beverly Hills, Kyle's rumor divorce. Are we going to see that play out? What can you tell us? You're going to see everything play out. We're in production right now, so there's not much more I can say. Kathy coming back? Yeah. That's going to be fun. Yeah. It'd be great. That. Yeah. And then New York. Crystal out. Who are we expecting to see on New York now? A New York Crystal was out of Beverly Hills. Um, New York, I think we announced the cast, but we're in production now, and so there's not much more I can say. Yeah. And Father's Day is right around the corner. How are you celebrating? I will be celebrating by spending a lot of time in my car driving back from the beach with the kids. So I'm sure I'll be ready to uh, celebrate when I get back into town. I'll give you a little. <laughs> See, this is why you do this. So sweet. So sweet. So is Ben gonna make you a handmade card? Does he get you a little gift? He'll probably make me art. He's very into art. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you so much. You.